Time now for the mix. You know how everyone's always talking about how millennials are just not motivated, mm -hmm. they don't really do anything, they no. don't want to work. No. Well, I want you to meet Erin Schrode. She started an eco platform and an environmental nonprofit turning green when she was just 13 years old. Huh. Now, at the ripe age of 25, she is running for Congress. Overachiever. She agreed and officially declared her candidacy for Congress in California's 2nd District. She was actually still just 24 at the time. <laughs> now, a few weeks later, she is officially 25. But her campaign is in full swing. Very much a millennial campaign. She uses Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook in the savvy way that only a digital native could. Okay. And uh, she actually made her official announcement she might on have Facebook future. as well. You know, Paul Ryan first went to Congress when he was in his 20s, so. Erin Schrode, look out for her. Exactly. All right, so I guess the popular gift on Mother's Day was all about Beyonce. Really? Yeah. Take a look. Are you <laughs> <laughs> Well, Beyonce at the end of May. You and I are going to see Beyonce? Yep. Do you me? No. <laughs> I love her mouth. <laughs> Mom lost her manners there for a second. So there were this so This is a trend. Many, this is a thing? This here? was a big thing. It was trending on Twitter. Um, after Sunday, a lot of kids gave their parents, or gave their mom, Beyonce tickets to the Formation Tour. We got Mama back. Is that... Is Look that, at that one. That one even came with some signs as well. You got Mama bag? Yeah, we got our handbag. Now, a very nice about handbag. A slacker. She liked it a lot. It was really nice. It's great. All right. Now oh, I'm, that's, now that's I'm wondering the maybe I should have gotten yeah. Beyonce tickets instead. Yeah. Sure, they'll give Dad some <clears throat> tickets as well for Father's Day. So that's what happens when you take Mom to Beyonce. Yeah. This is what happens when you surprise your daughter at college. Or rather, this is the, probably the most benign outcome if you surprise <laughs> your daughter at college. This particular mom decided it would be a good effort for her to just show up at her daughter's school. And so when she arrived at her daughter's dorm room and um, she wasn't there, she thought it would be funny to send her a photo. Okay. She said, look where I am. The daughter said, well, where? Where are you, mom? She said, well, in my bed. Guess what? Wasn't in her bed. She, she was in the wrong dorm room altogether. Doesn't she know what her daughter's uh, linen? I, I guess not. She said the room was all packed up for summer, so uh -huh. it looked like it could have been my dorm room. Okay, all right. That's she says little, it wasn't that far away. It's a little odd. I wonder how she got in, and also, thank the Lord that's all you found. <laughs> Sorry. It's, it's, Don't surprise your children in college. It's just not it's a good idea. It's just not a great idea at all. Can you imagine if your mom surprised your college? I mean, I would have been reading.